how to show FPS meter or FPS counter on any Android 10 device. Hey peeps, what's up? Manchi here, back with another video. And in this video, I'm going to show you how you can show FPS meter or FPS counter on any Android 10 device. As you can see, I do have the POCO F1 running MIUI 11 based on Android 10. And what are the prerequisites for this video? Well, the prerequisite for this video is that you need to be rooted using Magisk and you need to have Magisk Manager installed. All the files and APKs which we're going to use in this video are linked in the description of the video and you need two files. So you need the KF Mark Enabler zip file. This is a Magisk module. And then the next thing you need is the KF Mark APK. And this is the APK which I'm talking about, KF Mark. APK as I mentioned earlier links to both of these can be found in the description of this video Next thing we need to do is we'll open Magisk manager click on the three bar menu on the top left go into Modules as you can see the only module I have installed right now is wiper for Android FX and that in no way should interfere with Us showing the FPS meter or FPS counter on our Android device So we'll click on the plus sign next thing click on the three dot menu on the top right and select show internal storage if you get the option as hide internal storage, then you need not do anything. Next, we'll click on the three bar menu on the top left and select the device's name, in this case, the POCO F1. Now you need to navigate to the folder where you have downloaded the zip file. In case you downloaded the file on your phone directly, it will be in the download folder. In my case, I have transferred it manually, so it is in the root directory. And the file which we are looking for is the KF Mark Enabler. This is the file. All you need to do is select the file. Wait for Magisk to do its thing, which is to install the module. Once that is done, click on Reboot. Back into Android, we will unlock our device, open Magisk Manager, and then click on the three bar menu on the top left. Go into Modules, make sure that KF Mark Enabler was installed and it is active. How do you know it is active? You can tell that by the check mark inside the circle. Next thing you need is any file manager application which will let you install an APK. I am using the inbuilt file manager from MIUI. You can use FX File Explorer or ES File Explorer, whatever floats your boat. So in my case, I'll open the File Manager application and go into APKs and then select the KF Mark APK, click on Install. Do note the app is in Chinese, but it is open source. So those of you who are worried about your security and privacy, we do have the link for the GitHub source code for KF Mark in the description of the video and you can Check that out. Next thing, we'll open our application drawer and look for the KF Mark application. And once we find it, we can drag and drop it to our desktop or the home screen. Open the application and it will ask access to a media. Click on allow. And now, as you can see, the menu is in Chinese. Nothing to worry. So, this button which you see here is to add the applications. Tap on it, it will list all the applications which are installed on your device and all you need to do is let's say we choose chrome right so now chrome is added over here which means that the fps meter or the fps counter will be displayed in chrome now you have two buttons here which are kind of self-explanatory play button will launch the application and the delete button is used to remove this application from the list so we'll click on the play button and here you need to click on the second option it is going to ask you permission to display over other apps because the FPS meter or FPS counter will be displayed as a floating window. So enable the toggle, then go back, click on play one more time, and now it will launch the Chrome application. I do not want any sync, and bam, there it is. You can see that we have the FPS counter on the top. You can always move it wherever you feel like. And similarly, all you need to do is, you know, add your PUBG mobile or Fortnite game using the same option which we used just now so go back into kf mark click on this add any other application and you should have the fps meter in a floating window in that application as well there it is peeps that is how you add a fps counter or fps meter to any android 10 device and that will do it for this video hope my video helped you likes shares and subscribes are appreciated feedback and comment more than welcome see you when i see you